Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, and today this video is about Microsoft's Windows 11 Insider Preview Build, 22631.2048, which is released to the beta channel. As a reminder, Insiders previously on Build 22624 will automatically get moved to Build 22631 via an enablement package. The enablement package artificially increments the build number for the update, with new features getting rolled out and turned on to make it easier to differentiate from devices, with the update with features off by default. This approach is being used for the beta channel only and is not indicative of any changes or plans for final feature rollouts. Insiders who landed in the group with new features turned off by default build, 22621 can check for updates and choose to install the update that will have features rolling out build 22631. Starting with this build, and talking about what's new in build. In this build, we have Gallery and File Explorer, Microsoft is introducing Gallery, a new feature in File Explorer designed to make it easy to access your photo collection. The set of content shown in Gallery is the same as what you'll see in the All Photos view in the Photos app. Moving forward, and talking about the changes and improvements in Build. In general, Windows Insiders on Build 22631 will see the versioning updated under Settings, System, About, and Winver, to version 23H2. This denotes that Windows 11. Version 23H2 will be this year's annual feature update which will be delivered to customers similar to the most recent Windows 10 feature updates. As mentioned here, Windows 11 will have an annual feature update cadence that releases in the second half of the calendar year. For taskbar and system tray, after updating to this build, the ability to end task when right-clicking an app on the taskbar may appear, however this feature currently does not work correctly and will be fixed in a future flight in the beta channel. The setting for it under settings, system, for developers also currently does not show. For file explorer, Microsoft has added the ability to tear out and merge tabs in File Explorer. For developers, Microsoft is moving the For Developers Settings page from Settings, Privacy and Security to now be under Settings, System. Moving forward and talking about the fixes in Build 22631.2048. Moving forward and talking about the fixes in Build 22631.2048. For Taskbar, fixed an issue that could cause the taskbar to hang during initialization and not complete loading. For File Explorer, fixed an issue that could lead to explorer.exe crashes when opening a folder containing .webp files. Also, did some work to help address an issue where file explorer might hang when browsing network shares. For notification, fixed an issue where you might unexpectedly see a suggestion to turn off notifications that you regularly interacted with. Lastly, we have Microsoft Store update in this build. Windows Insiders in all channels running version 22306.1401 of the Microsoft Store and higher will see the following improvements rolling out, more pricing information, to help you with your purchase decisions, you'll now see information about the lowest price products have dropped to in the past 30 days. Introducing AI Hub, explore a new curated section in the Microsoft Store where Microsoft will promote the best AI experiences built by the developer community in Microsoft. This is a space where Microsoft will educate customers on how to start and expand their AI journey, inspiring them to use AI in everyday ways to boost productivity, spark creativity and so much more. So that was all from Microsoft for this build. If you want to know more, follow the link to the official Microsoft blog from the description. Hope it was useful consider like for the video, subscribe to the channel and if you have any questions, just comment down below. Thanks for watching and have a great day ahead. So that was all from Microsoft for this build. If you want to know more, follow the link to the official Microsoft blog from the description. Hope it was useful consider like for the video, subscribe to the channel and if you have any questions, just comment down below. Thanks for watching and have a great day ahead.